snowflake. I want to live somewhere that feels not so heavy. I, I live on its back with Dora. She has a blue glittery shirt that looks like mine. And her home looks like mine too. If we lived on a snowflake, we would be in a big silver and white ballroom where we would swing off chandeliers and wear tinfoil hats. And we would land together on the quiet, snowy earth. I like Dora. We sometimes play catch with paper airplanes that carry maps to our favorite places. And sometimes when I'm in my bed and Dora is in her bed, we look into our belly buttons and pretend they are wishing wells. Sometimes I pretend mine is a blowhole for a big whale that lives in my bloodstream. Sometimes, sometimes, it's easier to pretend I'm part whale or falling from the sky. I don't, I don't know what this closeness means. I have to play, pretend to feel something that feels real. A uh, close feeling, feeling close to a girl. That's my friend, one that knows all the things that makes me feel strong and warm and at home. This is, this is kind of like a crush. I think I had one before. His name was Ishtavan. He, he laughed when I told him about my belly button and the things and the colors I see when I squint my eyes out my bedroom window to look for the glimmer of tinfoil stars. He made me feel like, like, a leftover idea crumbled into a piece of notebook paper. Can a crush make me feel big? Big feelings and big smiles that come with matching hurt and blue shirts. I have big feelings with Dora. They make the boat we built out of the refrigerator box in the basement feel as quiet as the falling snow. And they make a person feel dear, like like a dear, dear home that we built all by ourselves.